quarter to eight and we have had our breakfast. We're just going to go downstairs to get our bus. We are heading to the Macon Delta today. Bus is here, finally. Yay. Oh, it's nice and cold. Uh, left. Oh, and the bus is a nice bus, isn't it? It's so nice and cold. The aircon seems like it's been on for ages, like compared to yesterday. So, yes, oh, the last time we went on the bus, the bus aircon wasn't working very well. This is nice. After about, how long have we been on the bus then, for Stephen? About an hour and a half. About an hour and a half on the bus. We've arrived at our first little stop off, and it is. I can't remember the name of what he said now, I'll try and find out. There are yes, temples, there is some Buddhism things. We're gonna go and have a little wander. We've got about only about half an hour to explore around here before we have to get back on the bus. So here is Buddha number one. Yep, yeah, there I can see another one over there, there's a laughing Buddha over there. My favorite, I like this. Buddha lying down. I had to go special. Okay, that was our quick stop off at this first place. I still haven't found out what this place is called. I need, I really need to do that. We are going back on the bus now to go to our next place. Okay, here's the Google map of where we are. You can see like the three statues and this is what it says it's called, Chua Vin Trang. Next stop, we were like five minutes away. We're now at the bus stop. We're gonna go and get on a boat to go on the Mekong River, I think, I'm assuming. The boat station. Here we are at Mei Ha City. Uh, M Y T H O of my four city, and now we go to Unicorn Island, and then we stop here to enjoy the music, and then we take robot. This one. <coughs> and then you know uh, we go straight to Bunchai Province, Bunchai Province, which is famous for its kind of kingdom. It has more than nineteen thousand hectares of. Yeah. Okay, so here we are. Off to go and get our boat to the Unicorn Island. That's what he said, I think. Yep. No. Here's our boat. That place. Yeah, go on, get on. What? Oh, where should we go? Anywhere. Middle. Thank you. 
<laughs> so we've just sat down and had some nice exotic food whilst listening to some of that music traditional i'm assuming traditional vietnamese music we're heading through now don't know where through there's some banana cheese look the banana cheese and is that jackfruit or durian jackfruit Mm -hmm. Cookie ghosts. What? Cookie ghosts. <laughs> Cookie goats. Whoa. They are crazy. They're massive. Whoa. Look at that. And the, yeah. They're going to be little bananas. That is mad. Okay, we're going on a rowing boat now. <laughs> I'm first, this is Russian. Who now? 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 Who Hello. Our next stop that we're going to is we're just like walking along and we're just going to it, we're not getting back on the boat or anything. We're going to um, a bee farm, I think. We're going to have some honey tea. Honey tea. Great. Okay, uh, guys, look at this one. Whoa. They are honeybee, local people, freedom. Nectar from Northern Tree. <laughs> no way. Give me, give me your camera. Is it on? Um. Oh my <laughs> We finished at the kind of bee farm honey place. These like thing about this tour is it is all set up to very touristy and very just set up to make money off of you, um I suppose early. But we're going back on the um on the boat now. Get back on. Ooh. Thank you. We are now getting off our big boat and switching to a smaller boat. A restaurant for some lunch. She's hungry. We were saying to Steve, I'm not that hungry because I've had loads of that fruit and we had like banana chips and things. Not that hungry to be honest, but I'm thirsty though. We got a lunch included with the price of this tour. We got rice, tofu, some greens, and spring rolls. I'm not sure if these are vegetarian. They're probably not. We finished our lunch. We're both absolutely stuffed. After that, we're now, we've got like an hour, well we had an hour eating our lunch, that was like 10 minutes, <laughs> and there's a few things to do around here, we can, there's crocodiles, which I'm thinking, crocodiles, um, oh thank you, crocodiles were on the menu at that place we've just been to, so I'm thinking these are crocodiles, 
that they use for breeding or I don't know, I don't know, I don't, know. I don't like things like this. But anyway, there's some crocodiles here, but we can see there's some hammocks, we can just go and relax in and there's bike rides and things, so. Whoa. Oh my goodness, there really is loads. Look at all these, yeah. There's still more things. Look how still they are. Oh, that one there is wobbling around. <laughs> Which one? Him on the ground. Oh yeah, I see him. Moving his head. But other than that, they're just completely still. Yeah, he's squished. All well, the others are squishing him. If you drop something in there, they'd all rush after it. Mm. She's walking over the other one. <laughs> it's like, I'm too hot now. I need to go and cool down. Look at his, like... Look, imagine. Look, he's gone. Look. Okay, there's others. Oh! Oh, whoa. Frogs. No. Do they eat frog? I'm assuming they do. Yeah, you can Aww, poor little things. No, I want to free them all. Oh, there's another yeah. tank of them, is there? Them oh my goodness, are they porcupine? No. no. I think they might be. I know. I'm sure they are. Oh, Me and Stephen are having an argument about these animals. I think they're porcupines, so I've just googled porcupine and showed Stephen some images and he says they're not porcupine, they don't look anything like them. Mm, I'm pretty they sure they are. Mm. Look at the colours of these birds, how beautiful. We're going to have a little relax in a hammock, I think. Yeah. Is it relaxing? Yeah, We're gonna have a little sleep. We've got half an hour. Stephen has just been getting swung by this man. <laughs> We've got about 15 minutes left, so we found a hammock. Got him one together. Just gonna chill out for a little bit. Stephen's looking for Audible to find um, the store he's listening to. Yeah. This is very really nice. I could just fall asleep here, I think. It's a shame we've only got 10 more minutes before we have to leave. Could you just fall asleep here? Hey. What? Could you just fall asleep? Did I? Would you? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. This one, Thank water corners. Ah. Water corners have no juice, so people okay. put okay. juice on it. Ah. In it. Do you want to try some? No. This is coconut water and the things. I don't really understand. They're these. Oh, these here. And then pour into the drink. Oh, wow. Oh, there's a puppy. And then we put the man and then bread and bread out to get the coconut meal. Uh, beside the coconut meal, we have the coconut shell. Coconut shell here Superman. is very important to you know, mm -hmm. shelter. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Oh, what a waste. So, you know, in the past, we didn't have this machine. So, we used this tool to shred and flash. No, this way doesn't bring a high productivity. Use this one. Hang on, this one. In the past, like this. Mm. Have it, please. Give it a try. Stop one. Cook that candy. Nice. Feel free to walk around here. Oh look, they're making the uh, packaging it up. It actually is, this is like the end product. Got nuts in. 
That's our short and sweet stop at the uh, coconut sweet factory. John, we're off now. Don't know where to. Oh, I see boats. I think we're heading back onto the boat. Boat 49. We're on. We've lost our tour guide. I don't follow the tour guide. I follow that. See that guy there, the bald guy. I follow him because he's like big and tall. <laughs> I can see him. We're getting back on our bus now. Heading back. I think we're like an hour and a half ride. Back to um, Ho Chi Minh. We've arrived back in Ho Chi Minh. Our hotel is just back there. Let's go. Where we've got off the bus, we don't really know if this has been here before, but we've not seen it before. Like hey, there's a market that's popped up with all sorts of food and stuff like just literally just opposite our hotel. It's been awesome. Whoa, we get out. It's a bit chocker. Yeah, yeah. It's a bit chocker in there to be honest. We're going back to the hotel. I'm back, my battery's dying, so we're gonna go back to the hotel, put this on charge. I don't know what we're doing, it's our last evening in Ho Chi Minh and in Vietnam actually, so I don't know, we probably will head back out for a little bit. But we are heading out for our last evening, we're gonna go and grab something to eat, just have a little wander. We have eaten and we are heading back. Personally, I would quite like to go and not get one over preferably go and have a few beers down this street here but Stephen doesn't want to and I'm going to be sensible, go home, do some work and um, get ready for tomorrow where we move on to Cambodia. But I'm going to end the vlog here so thank you for watching. I hope you've had a wonderful, what day are we on? Saturday. Have you had a wonderful Saturday whatever you've done and I will see you guys tomorrow. It won't be Saturday by the time I have loaded, so I'm very behind, very behind with stuff I am, but never mind. Um, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow when we will be getting the fourth cross of over to Cambodia and I'll show you how that's done. I don't know at the moment, but we shall just see. Good night, see you tomorrow. Yeah, you are gone. Just go right to the end of the floor and just skate yeah. all the way along. Yeah. Okay, good. Do whatever you can do.